Hey guys and gals, welcome back to my playthrough of Warhammer 40k Rogue Trader. Now, last we left off, we tried to get the uh, official papers for Jay. That was a slog. And in after that, we tried to move on to the uh, the last colony, Vivos 4, I believe. So, uh, yeah, let's go. You know what? Let's deal with these guys first. Their efforts will be for naught. Okay, now where? Last hatred frigates. Yikes. Yes. Take effect of this. Wait, what? Sun hammer, lance battery, and torpedoes. Uh, duration. Okay, let's come over here. Okay. Do this. Damn it. Whatever. Uh, do this. Please. Okay. Yeah. So, uh. The. Okay, wait a second. Let me. Spring. Let me fortify the, uh, prowl first. Let's go. Of course, they're gonna shoot me at the sides. Yep, they're gonna shoot me at the sides. What the hell? Okay, that's just BS. Come over here. No mercy for the enemies of humanity. This. Okay, please. Target disruption. An unsophisticated victory. That was easier than I thought. Okay, what can I strengthen? Uh, first of all, repair. Uh, okay, group. okay, let's do this. And let's see. Yeah, now I can start using you. Wait, I can upgrade there. Uh, uh recovers. Defense penalty. I can upgrade this. I can upgrade this. New headings. All integrity, no damage. What do I get for upgrading them? Okay, first of all, how many scraps I got? Let's hold out on that. And, uh, let me save. Okay, let's uh, land on this planet. Swift and merciless retribution is a proper fate for many transgressor transgressors, but the Imperium permits use of using the convicts for hard labor on distant present worlds like Viabos Six. Sorry, to atone for their crimes before before humankind, hundreds and thousands of rogues and lowlifes toil in the mines of the Vodvanesips, protectorate until death from exhaustion or some other unfortunate accidents claim their forsaken souls. Okay. Damn, but de, 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 de. do I want to bring Heinrichs? That would be a smart idea. Yeah, let's go with this selection. Okay, uh, first of all, yeah, you, I need to rearm you.
this. Uh, something, I guess. Okay. Leobosix always was a penal world. But this... Even the miscreants of this place do not deserve such a fate. I believe many of them do, but not at the hands of Xenos. The man's body is frozen in an unnatural pose. The corpse's fingers are crooked and its teeth are buried in ghastly grimace. A plan. Is this a Drukari raid? It looks like the aftermath of it. The man's caught out his throat right before he died. The broken, slashed, and gutted body is still covered with the shreds of planetary war uniforms. The caustic ooze gives us a sickly vapor that eats away at the lining of your nose and mouth and makes you and makes your eyes water. Their bodies has been twisted into a post resembling a servile bow and bound with barbed wire. Yeah, I have a feeling this is an aftermath of a Drukari raid. The throw gladiator. Gladiator? I always keep my options open. You can clearly see several thin cuts left by the bot left by the weapons on the body. This sounds like Drukari an aftermath of a Drukari raid, but somehow I have these guys to contend with. Enthralled Gladiator. Okay, let me save. Okay, where did they get all the stuff? Who are they? Okay. The tall, lithe Xeno moves with grace of an otherworldly predator. The creature gives you a dispassionate glance and casually speaks a few words that are immediately picked up by the Ecolator. Mikandis, Elieth, what is this? As one of the sisters found an amusing trinket in the ruins that saved it as a special treat for the Archon, the Xenos take a quick look over her shoulder towards the platform where a few silhouettes in tar black armor can be seen. Heinrich narrow narrows his eyes to give the Xenos a piece of praising The Drukari of this breed are known as witches. Of course, gladiators, witches, of course. I was saying, they are exports at bloodlaying in the arenas and on the battlefield. However, I am more interested in the ones skulking in the shadows. Judging by their armor, they are high ranking representatives of a cabal, a military clique of the Drukari de demands. Demands. It seems that we have disrupted the vile performance of their distinguished guests. Uh, by whose leave are you playing Lord of my world? Xeno, I laid up an interest. The monkey understands my speech. Where do you come by a device that can translate your language? Are you trying to impress me by appearing useful? Such words will earn you a bout in your ring at most, without weapons and soon without your skin. The humans scattered around you on the platform stares as if they're seeing a ghost. The eye of some betray their fear and glare. Others glare with bestial hatred, and yet more look upon you with hope. Who are you? My name is known to everyone on this planet, Monkey. I'm Tazara the Deliverer, Tazara the Benevolent, the one who grants respect from the choking grasp of this world. I decide who lives, who dies, and who finds new purpose for their existence in the Comrade's many areas. Surely this is why you have come here, to fight for my for my ever-changing favor and for the privilege of being the first to be chained. Let's see this. The principle of stupidity in it, okay. From the dust behind Tarsa comes a cry. The distance between you and the Xenos is too great for the Ecclesiator to interpret the words, but the tone alone speaks to the irritation and impatience. Looks like the spectators grew bored and the performance hit a snack. Hazara raises her blade and points at you. Tell the other monkey that whoever slits your throat with the part for their new home ahead of schedule, and tell them to hold nothing back. Tonight they dance for Emirius herself, the great archon of the Cabal of the Right Raving Tempest. Uh, let's see this. What did I say? Uh, dying to entertain the Xenos is a path to eternal shame and condemnation. Of souls touched by the Emperor's undying, undying glory. Let us join our place. We will destroy these, those who sought to kill you. Exhausted and defeated forces trait, weary glance. The hulking brute next to you hesitates, then spits a broke, then spits and breaks into a grin. We are going to die anyway. Might as well do it without the heretic's brand. Slay the beast. The mirror emits a furious scream and takes the back, ignoring her companions. Kind has no right to exist. Do not plead for swift death! Okay. So there's a witch, witch. Hmm. Okay, wait a second, wait a second. If this is a Drukari, I want to bring Yurla with me. Okay, uh, let's see. Heinrichs, I need to re-equip re -equip you.
Okay. Let me save. Rise to the top, or get left in the dust. The Imperium is laughably unoriginal in its educational methods. Corrective labor in the mines. Places like this show mercy to no one, adult or child. These transgressors ought to be weeping in gratitude for being given a chance to atone through hard labor. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's pretty much the same thing. Okay. Always keep your eye on the price. Uh, wait a second, wait a second. What type of, uh... Race to the top. Ah, sure, why not? No. Uh, what's my... Dogmatic, and then the... Heretical... Of course, there's none. Without the dilly dally, let's Is there go. Money to be made? <clears throat> and okay. And judge by the armor, the hierarchy represents the cabal. Yeah, yeah. Uh, this. Who are you? Okay. Wait, what? Yes, surely it's why you have come here to fight my ever changing flavor, flavor and the privilege of being the first to be chained. Such grandiose name for a soulless wretch who tortures the breathless and torments the powerless. Your work hints at a nobility you, ne you have never possessed. Cousin, what are you doing among these rabble? What an unexpected and tantalizing surprise! Nazara licks her lips hungrily. I cannot wait to take you in my arms and clasp, clasp you tightly to me. I mean, is she... like... Is she, does she swing that way? But uh, then again, this is Drakari. They swing every single direction. Do not waste your breath on your lies. Only the faint vestige, visage of blood connect the Asuyani and the Dark Ones such as yourself. Uh, let's do this. It could be perhaps my mere presence is enough to make base creatures like yours, you yourselves, forget how to breathe. Thursday lets out a nasty chuckle, and you're ready. And you're, are you really surprised at what happened? You wove the net right under your own feet. You merely knocked down, knock out the pin that drew it close tight around you. A couple of volleys at the seal on the underground well, and the planet, the ones you have turned inside out, did the rest. Okay, uh. Oh, how do you strive? And your brethren finished what the planet has started. Oh, how they strive to please me and my entourage. How they slaughtered and tortured their own kin for mine and my sister's delight. How they decorate this little arena with still living monkey. Do you think all that you see before you is a work of your hands? Work of our hands? Think again. Uh, let's do this. Okay. Uh, okay. Do this. Alright. You dare cross the cast balcony. A poor decision. Who will agonize next? Okay. Uh, do I have to worry about them as well? Which gunslinger? Yes, uh... Over here, and uh, do they climb up or do they have to go around? I have a feeling they have to go around. So, you know what? Let's place it one over let's here. Let's make some opportunities. Oh, uh, let's see. Sniper over this here. As good as done. This one, just put it over here. If not me. On it. Let's see, uh, this one. And then, uh, I'll see to it this. personally. Okay. Make a tricks. We got which? Which gunslingers? Let's see this. Yeah. I'll make it happen. Okay, okay. Uh, I'm done. I approach the designated position. Okay, hemorrhage. You. Uh, I'll show you the real pain. Uh, how much do you have? Three. Why do you have so little? No, 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 no. This tedium is beneath me. Yeah. I understand your intent. Really? If I must. Yes. Malice drives me. Ugh. Bow to me. Ugh, oh, crap. Yeesh. Okay, Argenta, you come over here. Really? 
This is gonna be very... I see this. Unwise. Now that's this. for the weak. Let the true master inflict the pain. As the emperor commands, I act. No, you don't have to right. I'll do it. <laughs> be delectable. Faith without deeds is worthless. I'll do it. Okay. As the emperor commands, I act. Beautiful. And I uh, do this. Uh, you will pay for this in blood. Okay, you should be uh permanent. What's this? Crap. I need to take you out. ASAP. I oh, no. Okay, whatever. Uh, somebody died. Show me what you've got. Just yell at the lightning. Okay. Ouch. Frog gladiator. Okay, just move you over I here. Have read tomes of military tactics. No. Uh, let's see. The game. If I may. Do I'm this. not accustomed to being ordered around. Okay. Uh, now, just for the week. As the emperor commands, I act. That's why I was chosen. You the real pain. Oh, crap. Isn't this enough for the serfs? Oh, God, Lewis. Okay. Uh, no. It doesn't hit her. Crap. It will hit you. I am a navigator, not a soldier. Okay. Heinrichs, come in. I'll put my psychic abilities to use. This is very... Um... Very risky for him. Naturally. Yeah! Of course. No. Let's see to it. Good. I won't object to this. it. I'll return the pain tenfold. Alright. You come over... Here. Watch my back. Am I getting paid for this? Okay. That's nice. Don't get too cocky. Really? Okay, you know what? Do this. I want to try out the multi-melter. Are you kidding me? I won't do that. Okay, fine. Whatever. Thrones glory. Ah, uh, crap. I can do that with the right incentive. Okay. This can't be. Uh, yeah. I hold all the cards. Now you come over Rejoice here. In battle. Here you can draw shot. Now that's without deeds is worthless. You my emperor. Okay. None of you can escape the emperor's judgment. Right. I'm going this first. There is a who's this arena. You are the monkey. Archon your Miris. Recommend. Ah, you know this danger of competing as prisoner, okay? Where is Mike? It's Archon your Miris. So this is the So that's basically the um the next companion that you can recruit, I believe. So, uh, where can I go? I go over here? Nah, let's not. No, you know what? Let's... Run my little butt. Where can I go? I'm a bit exposed here and I'm afraid of a gun. As the Emperor commands, I act. Yeah, why not? for the weak. <laughs> Your skill is, that is not the Emperor's will. Let's make it quick. Okay. Out of my way. Wait, who are you? Don't let them tremble. What if I'm going to grenade? Yikes. Ugh. Hold on. Oh, that's a... Okay. Here we go. Alright. So, for me... Anu, come over here. Who is not me? Ah, crap. Wrong place. Whatever. My god tells me it's a bad idea. Yep. You will pay for this in blood. I'll make it happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How many foot do you have that for? That's this. I'll see to it personally. Now, that's this. Okay. Yeah. Uh, this serves your cause. <laughs> you call this a strike. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, this tedium is beneath me. Hey. Okay. Whatever. I deal death with my hands. Thank you. Nope. Oh, just come over here. And silent. Nope. That's just I this. will not. Really? Stop trying, monkey. Okay, whatever. Now you. Please, hit her. The emperor commands. I am. Thank you. <laughs> the surviving turns your head towards your uh, uh, All eyes on the battlefield are glued to you.
and I will order the new egg and by destroying the policy you need to atone for your transgression and let's go to the shuttle. Uh what have you stopped done with you yet? Go to the shuttle, the rest of you will be subjugated selective punitive subvertization, so you may Okay, let's do this. Okay, so poison hekatari Okay, but but just stop revolvers. Chain mails. Alrighty. Uh which armor? Keep your wits about you. I'm starting to wonder if I want to uh equip somebody with uh Drukari. They fear to look at me because of my I have a nose for profit and a taste for adventure. Yeah, basically I wanna find some if on the next um let's see. Armor Drukari equipment. I wanna test that out if I could wear out wear these Drukari armors. That's what I wanna try. Uh, let's see. Which What the hell is this? Ooh, lots of goodies. What the hell is this? Hunter Carapace. Uh, base armor property. Okay. Wow, this is actually better. Well, it's medium. I mean, why not? Yeah, why not? Who's still packing the like normal? Yeah, let's just wait. Is this better than? Yeah, it's better. You have skin, skin. You have this. You have other ranger armor. Willpower more than fifty-five. Hmm. I think need, I need to up your willpower. Oh well. Uh, let's see. The body was just partially flayed. Judging by the amount of blood, the victim is still alive when it happened. Yeesh. What's a peculiar thing? What the hell is this? Ooh. Okay. I glad I'm glad I did that. Now. Oh. Where do I go? Here, I guess. There's no doubt the dark ones left side aside. We treat them to an exquisite feast of pain I and misery. I keep my options open. So what? I'm done here? Really? I'm just done? Yeah, I think I'm done. Oh wait. Pay attention. A massive crusher designed to extract ore from the rocks covered with a layer of dust and rubble. Okay, wait. Let me save. Please. And done. Okay, scorpion sting. And melt a charge. Okay, this is actually not bad. Wow. Let us not dawdle. Okay, let's get back to the shuttle. Rise to the top. Captain Pulse is held master inspector. Okay, new contract, whatever. Oh, uh, okay, what do I get from here? Punishment for the thinkers. Punishment for the outsiders. Punishment for by calculation. Against human enemies. Secret minus two. Damn, everything minus two. Complacency minus two. Efficiency minus two. Imperial Navy.
Da. Our allies gain critical damage. I mean, but I get a lot of stuff. If these new convicts, the quarries can be filled with prisoners taken from foreign worlds. Literate idle thinkers. Psychers and. He has psychers and navigators. What? I mean, this is just better, right? It's human enemies. Uh, security. We're just foreign criminals and potential. It's a potential solution to this problem. Agency. Yeah, let's do this. I want to get some better guns for my ship. Ground workers, dreamless security, warp guides. Okay, there's the fields, blood sport, killing fields. Uh, there are no more comics. There are now more comics that work. Symbols can be expelled from their quarries. Over time, they will run wild and hard, and from them, you can also select fighters for services. There are now more comics that and we're gladiatory arenas will recycle this supplies to the delight of visiting aristocrats. Wrath of the Veil Rabble. For all colonies. Envirodome. I get these two. Okay, whatever. Let me save. Get this. And let me just scan this one. Alright, I actually, I will admit one thing, I actually tried this, tried to record this a few times, and every single time when I try to do this, uh, planet, it keeps freezing and crashing, so I don't know why. So, I'm gonna save here, and try to do it again. If it still have that problem, I'm just gonna skip this planet entirely. Okay. Uh, this. Okay. Give it this. Okay. It doesn't now. Okay. Let's see what. The look at this since. It's delighted. Already explored. Okay. I don't know why it suddenly freeze on me, but hey, at the very least, it's. Uh, fixed. Now, of course. Oh, Eldari survivors. So yeah. Whoa, Lord Captain Drakari ships are patrolling this system. The likelihood of slipping past a patrol notice is close to zero. Why the hell are there so many Drukhari ships?
Okay, you know what? Let me just deal with the survivors. The armor group because of a heavily damaged Xeno void ship belonged to countless rock masses of the asteroid belt, an Aldari vessel beyond a doubt. According to the Pompalensis archives, about a hundred standard years ago, the Imperial Navy set up a barrier in this system against pirates and enemies of humanity. Countless prime mines are still scattered amongst the wreckage. The Voxmaster manages to tune the ship's system to an unconventional frequency, and the bridge suddenly fills with chime-like Xeno's voices, drawn out and mournful. They sing in an unknown tongue, but every officer in the bridge can sense that this is a dirge. Answering the call, Yurla jumps through the cogitators, start startling the officers on the bridge with her sudden jolt. In the hopes of understanding the monkey technology and figuring out how to help her kin, the Aldari runs in circles around blinking bit screens, but the mysteries of the machine gun eludes the Xenos. Then she turns to Lord Captain, powerless. Yurla is asking the Eltar to help her kin who have found themselves trapped in a snare of fate. The Aldari are enervated and weak, and their song is a cry of despair, a crying that is fading. Uh, order service machine called prepare. Uh, logistics officer led by the Master Helms Marine ordered the pilot to course of the rescue search shuttle to the uh, Let's do this. Okay. Now, th now all the crew can do is hope that the calculations are correct and that the veterans officers' experience have not let them down. Uh, inquire after the state. The Aldari hulls, vessel's hulls and engine has. Per has presumably been damaged in a collision with a small celestial body. However, it is impossible to prove or disprove this hypothesis at such a distance. The Xenos vessels differ too much from those of Imperium. Uh, safe the Xenos is impossible. At least the system is made of safe for travel. The rogue trader orders to minefield detonate, taking the Eldari in the void ship. Uh, in hopes, no. Let's do this. However, the Xenos do not respond to incoming signals. After several attempts, the frequency turn tuned by the Voxmaster get lost, and the mournful songs fade away. Let's do this. After several hours passing the ship's clock, the servants on the side present a plan for the neutralization of the ancient mines. Okay, the success of the operation is assessed as extremely probable. Uh, since the shuttle with the experienced pilot scout. Let's do this. The shuttle enters the asteroid void. The pilots proceed with caution, confidently avoiding the chunks of rock and nearby impossible mines. However, when the shuttle reaches the Xeno ship, the rescue team report catches bridge the bridge crew off guard. The vessel's starboard side has been breached by the macro weapon of an unknown Imperial void ship. There are no survivors. Shielding her eyes, Yurla cl closes them and clutches the spirit stone at her breast. Coming to, the Eldari does not speak for a time, with notes of sadness in her voice. Carefully picking her words, she concedes that the Elantar did all they could to save her kin, and yet it is the Monkai who are responsible for the loss of the Eldari Voidship. Saddened by the, pain, by the pain and hatred that human has brought upon her kind of... Okay, wait a second. Is it really impossible to save them? This, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Do this. Okay. Remember the reader? Question pen. It has already been sent to the Astro Park Pirate. When it may take some time to arrive. Okay. Uh, Jesus is the second most important MS. There's one of the seals. Okay, so he's on Janus. Other in distress. Then the last one is this one. Okay, let's get out of here. But, Lord Captain, urgent report, we have received an astropathic message from the region Aronto Orcelio. The navigators are concerned about the fate of Cassia, who disappeared from Eric 5. The region is requesting an update on her current status and her... And he has also inquired about the possibility of a personal meeting to negotiate to arrange the return of the lady navigator to her house. The psycho-emotional coding of the received message betrays acute concern, but it also contains something that the astropath has failed to put into words. If you'll excuse my for foresightedness, I feel it's necessary to tell House Orcelio the truth. Otherwise, a conflict with the navis ability is possible, which, given the current state of the Coronus expansion, will only play into the hands of the enemies of the period. Uh, yeah, how did I know? I wish I knew, Lord Captain. It is a troubling indeed. Perhaps we have a spy on board, or region of Aronto is bluffing. In either case, in either case, I believe we should respond. Navigators are extremely powerful and a useful ally to have. Uh, let's do this. I'll see to it, Lord Captain. The extra path will transmit your consent. Representative of House of Celio will be waiting for you at the capital world of Dragonis. We seem members of the Navis of Pelete will always be, is always a delicate matter. Please make sure to discuss the details of this meeting with your Chancellor upon arrival. Okay. Uh, I can't do jack for you now. 
Let's see, what can I build? Fortress will mechanize servants. Dark Sages. Well, it's dark. Well, that rules that out. A uh, Scorcher, or do I want this? This might be a smart idea. At least I can get Scorcher. Users gain 1 MP and immediately resets cooldown on all attacks and attack abilities. Okay. At the start of your user's next turn, they gain 1 stack of stagger that lasts until the end of combat. Eh, uh, sure. Alright. Oh, what the? Rook happened after the, com the, the after the decompression of Lady Theodora's secret workshop on Kiavagama, an epidemic of mysterious tech leprosy has broken out. Augments mutate into distorted forms, killing their hosts and their and the machines. Even entire as assembly halls have broken apart into fragments that devour each other, meddling into grotesque and insane forms. The Omega-18 manufacturer on the epicenter of the uh, epidemic is cordoned off, but the disease will burst out of nowhere sooner or later. Uh, what's known about the sickness? We have not faced anything like this before. The plague only affects mechanisms forcing them to transform and lose all functionality nobody knows the nature of this disease and how it is found how it found its way into lady theodora's secret workshop it is possible that some secret research were being carried out there uh one of my advisors eradicating the infection is our highest eye priority but a completely but to completely eradicate the manufacturer of epicenter would mean inflicting serious damage to our resource supply this unit i can propose another method of purging however the sacraments of the honor side that are available that are available to me cannot be revealed to the lady uh, i ask that you place your trust in me Shereen, do not be so hasty with this purge this phenomenon may be of interest to other specialists. There are many who do not agree that all knowledge belongs solely to Cox. What appears to be a play could hold amazing possibilities. If we could isolate the manufacturer and let these inquisitive minds aside, inside, they would happily compensate us for the loss of production cap capacity. I have suppressed 18 different epidemics aboard the flagship, and our officers have experience in setting, setting up quarantines. We will send them to Kiavagama to lead the tech purger squads. They will not return for the epicenter until the infection is eradicated and the the remaining components is taken out. Oh, why can I not send the... He... Yeah, why can I... Why can I not send this? Huh. You know what? This is mechanical stuff. Pascal, do your work. Your request is, ac is accepted. I shall withdraw to perform a sacrament. The tech priests armed with the mysterious device that they assembled under the instructions of Pascal have gone into the bowels of the manufacturer. What happened there is unknown. Reports speak of a blue and green flash that illuminated the, ma the manufacturer and the epidemic subsided overnight. The distorted mechanisms have been honorably melted down, and so are and so were the bodies of the, de the tech priests who carried the machine of the Magos Hanuman, Hanuman, as well as the burnt remains of the machine itself. Magos pa Pascal have ref has refused to comment on his chosen method of purging, saying it is a revelation of the Omnisaya that he himself could not comprehend before the device was given over. Many of the tech priests who have once maintained the manufacturer were left without a function and transferred to serve aboard the rope trader's ship. Okay. Uh, what can I build? Compassion for the silent. Armored rage. Okay, Titan Forge weapon. Why is this thing... Oh. Okay. A welcome guest. I need flank stuff for these. Okay, I need two. Craft factor one. Let's, let's do this. Janus, you're still doing this. Okay, restoration, good. Now, what can I get? Genetic mercy. Let's see. Let's do this first. Shield of the Emperor. Okay. Frack grenades. Ooh. This is a good thing to get. A wonder project has been completed. Shield of the Emperor of Filth of the Expanse. Hmm. Oh, so I get escort ships from here. Uh, let's get genetic mercy first. Lord Captain, a disturbing report that came from the quarries of people Six. The slave laborers have lost their minds. They forgot how to use tools. They held it together and continued to stare aimlessly into space, even under the lashes of the whips, ruining the mines' deadlines. 
Some people get obsessed with using their nails to color out the blasphemous symbols on the tools, on machines, and even on their own bodies. The, the most men have painted the walls of several mines from f floor to ceiling with these symbols that and then gone off deep into the mining tunnels. None of them could be found. The wardens considered it a performance to divert attention away from the escapes and, it, and an impending rebellion. What are those symbols being scratched out by the slaves? It is hard to give these drawings any sort of intelligible definition. Nat a naturally round circles connected by lines. The lines are interrupted by a group of dots. The pattern can sometimes follow some sort of logic and sometimes be unique. I can provide pics of them. After examining the figure, you realize that the symbols are connected through a strange logical sequence. What do I invite you to say? Spotting the intriguing pattern in the drawings of the symbols left by the prisoners. Hypothesis. They have a practical purpose. Requesting access to the mines and the right to investigate the specimen, the specimen for the Adeptus Mechanicus. Disappearing prisoners? What is the point of running away from penal servitude if the entire world is a prison cell? No, Shady. These us Ashmaks have found some sort of smuggling tunnel network that are hide and are hiding there. And the drawings are their secret language, which they use to give orders to their fellow prisoners. I know some guys who can find such secret places and decipher these languages. If the slaves will continue to disappear for no reason, then unrest will soon follow. Whether out of fear or disappearing themselves, or out of hope that the possibility of escape. To disciple this, we have to put pressure on the slave leaders. My experience suggests that such people can hold more sway than any warden. Uh, let's do this. There is no sacrifice more worthy than the ones done in the name of the search for knowledge. The wise servants of Omnisai have interrogated the strange prisoners. Which research on their brain's tissues did not reveal any mutations. There are these laborers who have completely lost their utility have been granted server server Servitorization in order to maintain production levels, but it seems in the end something was found at all. The drawing of the prisoners have been too systematic. They could not simply be gibberish. The sets of repeating elements of the dashes and dots are far too similar. But if it indeed was a secret language, then judging by its complexity and the impossibility of decoding it, the language was not de definitely not created by conf convict. Okay. Uh, dreamless. Ooh, what the hell is this? Extract them, Metallica. Okay, more like extract them. Explorators, Russians. Yeah, let's get doing these first. Okay. What happened? Our, astro our astropath receives a message from the Achilles Scalander on Dragonus. He's clearly, he closely studied the data from the incursion on Fiobos 6, including the mention of his Xenos leader. He promised a di to direct the efforts of his aides to identify those enemies of humanity so their location can be determined. Master Scalander also reporting the Drukhari are getting ready to for more attacks on your territory. Information on this from his aides continue to arrive, and Achilles will personally report to you the moment the target of the upcoming raid becomes clear. The Drukhari excel at catching their opponent opponents off guard, and there will be little time to mount a response. According to Master Scalander, your personal participation in the events will be the best strategy given the circumstances. Okay, wait for, for a response from Draconis. 